Hey, Ty, um, <clears throat> obviously you've been playing with Mike a lot the last few years in practicing games, but do you sometimes even marvel at some of the throws he makes and the plays he's able to make out there, especially today against a team that has this kind of talent? I mean, he just made some unbelievable throws to you guys, a number to you and also your teammates, but you kind of just kind of sit back and just say, wow, when you see some of the things he does. Oh, yeah. Mike's he's very special. I mean, you can you can look at the tape, make any throw on the field. He could he could just do anything. He's he's very special. I mean, some of the like when I go back and look at the film, I will see some special throws Mike makes. You know, Mike's he's a great playmaker. I I just love Mike. All right, John, and then Zach. Uh, Coach Allen was just talking about that. Obviously, you guys believe you could win this game and you expected to win it. Um, when you look back at the first half, I mean, just how disappointing is it? Just how that unfolded kind of put you guys behind where you had to chase. Yeah, it's, it was just it's very disappointing in the first half. I mean, we came out just sloppy, you know. That's that's the blame on everybody, you know. I mean, we just got to we gotta find a way to put four quarters together and just and that, that's when this football team will be really special when we find a way to put four quarters together. All right, Zach, and then Paul. I guess just asking about uh, your day and the matchups, just – what do you feel like really worked for you? You were going against, I think, a, a player that a lot of people feel is, is one of the best cover corners, not just in the Big Ten, but in the country. Just where do you feel like you kind of got the better of the matchups against Ohio State today? Oh, I mean, I was just, you know, moving around everywhere today. The coaches, they put me in great spots to make plays. But, you know, none of that matters when you lose. It's just disappointing. All right, Paul and then Tom. Hey, Ty, a, a year ago this game was – 51 to 10 and to, today you guys were right there all the way to the to the end talk about how much this team has grown since you guys played against them last year oh yeah this this team has grown a lot you know this team has a lot of fight in it you know I'm proud of how we came out the second half you know where most teams would just lay down I don't know what the score was like 35 7 28 7 but most teams would lay down you know this team has a lot of fight in it that's what I'm proud of we just got to find a way to put it all together all right, Tom, and then Kevin. I thought you guys had four plays of 50 yards or more today. You're really, you know, striking down field. Uh, did, what did you see with that secondary during film all week? And did, did, you, see, did you see things that, that, that might have happened today? I mean, yeah, I mean we, just, we studied a lot of film on them this week. They, they mix and match. They play a lot of different defenses. And coaches put us in great position to make plays. But, you know, at the end of the day, we didn't, we didn't make enough plays. All right, Kevin, then Evan. Hey, Ty, I know that, uh, you know, David Ellis moved to running back, but it seemed like he was split out a lot at receiver today. Uh, what kind of lift did he provide uh, to the passing game and the receiving game in terms of, uh, you know, helping bringing you guys back today? Yeah, David, David, you know, um, we're so happy to have him back. He came off a little, I don't know, a little injury or something, but, you know, we're happy to have him back. He's just a mix match, a mix match for, like, deep, you know, at running back, you know, linebackers have to cover him. He's just he's, – he's awesome. We're happy to have him back. All right, Evan, last one for Ty. Yeah, you talked about not laying down in that second half. You guys were down 35-7 to seven pretty early on. But you had 186 yards and three touchdowns in that second half. Um, what do you see for Penix that allowed him to take charge of the offense, and how did your connection work so well today? I mean, you know, Mike, you know, we got in the locker room. We came together as a team. We had a talk that we weren't going to lay down. And we, we came out fighting the second half. You know, we just got to just do better. We got to we got to play better. We got to come back better. We got, you know, we got a lot more games ahead of us. And we're going to, you know, take it each week at a time.